Now let me shift gears a little bit. Let me talk a little more detail on technology. So our work is about creating useful technology and supporting you, our users. Fundamentally, our work is about ArcGIS. ArcGIS is an integrated web GIS platform, providing mapping, analysis, data management, and collaboration across your organization and beyond. This is done by providing you apps, access and data management, and services and systems to support your decision making. This is deployable on premises, in the cloud, and most commonly in hybrid systems, taking advantage of the best of both worlds. A core aspect of ArcGIS is its power to integrate. In fact, you can think that GIS, the main fundamental power, is integration and analysis. With ArcGIS, we focus on abstracting and organizing all types of information by using what we call the geoinformation model. And what it really means is maps, layers, scenes, abstract the information coming from services and data files and imagery and LIDAR, and enterprise data and real-time feeds, they collapse into this layer of maps and layers that expose it up. So users don't need to worry about whether it's a SQL database or an Oracle database. They just see a layer of information. A core aspect of everything that we've done for over 20 years now is to provide an open platform to ensure interoperability and productivity across your systems. And we do this in a variety of ways. We support and embrace open standards and are participatory on many of these open committees. We support and embrace industry formats. There are many standards out there that are standards because they're practical and people use them. And we make sure those work for you. But we also focus on product integration, integrating technology, data, and services into the products where you need to be able to use them. So whether that's inside of AutoCAD or inside of Adobe or leveraging SAP HANA or Cognos. But it's also about open software. We have an open API. We have an extensible architecture. We have embeddable components. But we also contribute actively to the open source community. We have over 300 open source projects that we contribute to. We integrate open source components inside of ours. We contribute back. And we provide open data access to the contents to make it available to a larger community. And we also provide education materials for free to all the educational institutions around the world to help them help the world become geospatially literate so they understand how geography can help the world. Now, ArcGIS is fundamentally made up of several key components. And I want to spend a little bit talking about this integrated system. First off are apps. Apps are a key aspect of the platform. In fact, we provide ready-to-use maps and apps across the entire platform that are fully supported, maintained, and something you can use every day. We have apps for use in the field, in the office, and for everyone. In the field, we have apps that help you navigate based on where your features are. Link it to work orders to be able to plan your workforce, how they get from one task to another. We have tools for data collection, whether it's map-centric, like in Collector, or it's survey-centric in Survey123. In the office, we have a number of different apps for different roles, whether it's things that you know about, like Dashboard or an Explorer, or things that you may not have tried yet, like Maps for Office or ArcGIS Earth, or some new things, like Drone to Map to integrate drone imagery. Insights provide a visual interactive analysis tool. Integration with the Adobe Creative Cloud, so you can bring your content directly into Adobe for your illustrators and designers. And GeoPlanner to do geo design across collaboration to compare multiple scenarios. And when reaching out to everyone, whether that's internally for briefing and sharing information, 
or everyone is public, shareholder reports. Using story maps has become a very popular way of communicating the rich information that you maintain. Open data allows your data to be directly accessible. And many of you are starting to look at, well, how can you use crowdsourcing? Either crowdsourcing within your organization or beyond to provide another information feed. But we can't build every app you want. So we provide you a set of app builders. So you can build and customize your own apps. Whether it's simple configurable templates where you don't need to do any coding, or an interactive web app builder to build customized web HTML JavaScript applications, or App Studio, where you can configure and build native applications to run on handheld devices. All of these provide easy, configurable, and extensible tools for you to build your own apps. But one of the most common apps that every one of you use and have for many years is ArcGIS Desktop. And that's ArcMap and ArcGIS Pro. These are really the GIS professional apps that combine advanced mapping, visualization, editing, and analysis to allow you to do the hard work of GIS and the innovative analysis and ad hoc work that you have to do on a day-to-day -day basis. We continue to advance all of these, integrating them more into WebGIS, but also advancing the technology and tools available in each. ArcMap continues to be maintained and grow, and ArcGIS Pro has a lot of emphasis with new tools, new interfaces, to allow you to leverage this platform moving forward, taking advantage of the hardware and data that you have access to today. Some of the work that we've done is improving our analytics and 3D, but also working on space-time modeling. Integration with vector tile information, so you can publish vector tiles for, to the web, allowing you for very fast display across web browsers. And embracing image processing as a core aspect of what a GIS professional needs to do. LiDAR is increasingly common for many of applications, and we've improved our last tool support to make that easier. And based on your feedback and other users like you, we've reintroduced concurrent use licensing for ArcGIS Pro so that you can continue to use the license model that you're known and familiar with. 